All right, hi folks, John Richardson. Guarantee RV, the only dealer you ever need to remember. Today, I'm gonna to show you a 2000, believe it or not, 18 Dutchman Kodiak Ultima. This is a 28 foot. It's got bunk beds in it, big slide. We'll go all through it. This is a bear cage construction. It's all aluminum frame, very, very well built trailer very very clean so i'll talk to you a little bit about it if you don't know i've been here 27 years now i've done a few of these things the thing i'd like to talk about is one of the primary things that we do when we bring a trailer in whether we buy it outright or whether it's a trade it has to go through our service department where we have its 48 49 service bays has to go through a pre-delivery inspection. We want to make sure everything's good on it before you become the owner of it. Because I don't want to have to hide from you after the fact. I want it perfect when you take delivery of it. So that's why we do the things we do. Been doing it now for 52 years. So let's start on this. As you can see, it's got a fiberglass cap up here on the front. It's smooth fiberglass sides. This actually has what we call a gel coat finish, which is another finish on top of the fiberglass. So you can see the sheen of this thing. It just kind of, it's kind of like a clear coat on a paint job, if you will. Magnetic latches for the doors. You got a 50 amp cord here. We've got big storage here in the front, probably as big as anything I've seen underneath the bed. I'd also like to point out this has got four electric jacks for levelers. So you don't have to worry about cranking the old thing up and down. Magnetic latches, slam latch doors, let her go, it closes. As you can see on this side, we've got a nice big slide out. We'll go inside, take a look at that thing here. We have electric jack on the front. We got a couple five gallon propane tanks. By the way, you buy this rig, we're gonna fill them. We're gonna give you two brand spanking new batteries. We're going to do a complete walkthrough. We're going to give you a customer care kit. We're going to do, we're going to treat you like what you deserve to be, a king for the moment. We've got front caps on these guys. The idea of that is it gives you more aerodynamics so that you get better gas mileage going down the road. Let's go inside and take a peek and show you what we got. Of course, we got the other door here. I might point out we have outside speakers. We have an electric awning here, push a button. The old days of having to pull one out, it's gone. Got rope lighting in there, beautiful colors when you light it up at night. Now we're gonna slip in the bedroom. I might point out aluminum steps. We don't want this thing rusting or looking bad, neither do you. So you can see here in the bedroom, since we're coming in through the bedroom, you've got a nice full-size queen bed. Good storage across the top. Hanging closets on both sides. I'd like to point out here, you notice we've got an electrical outlet. We got one on the other side too. So should you need a CPAP machine or something like that, just plug it in, you got it. Pocket door, gonna close off the bedroom. So if somebody wants to sleep in on their vacation, they can do it and nobody will bother them. Now we come out here, and what I'd like to point out is, even though the colors all have a tendency to run to the darker colors to eliminate dirt and stuff, notice the floor, very, very light and bright. Gives, gives it kind of a cheery, cheery feeling when you're in it, especially if you're in it in the summertime, nice and bright. Everybody likes that. So you'll notice here we have solid surface. This is how new this thing is. There's a sticker that it come with. I don't think anybody's ever used it. Got a pull out faucet, got tags still hanging on everything. Got an under mount, under counter mount, stainless steel sink, pull out faucet. Good cabinets, I might add. It's all the LED lighting. That's pretty much the way it is now. Your electric slide out, push a button. We don't have to do anything anymore except get it from point A to point B and enjoy the heck out of it. So here in the living room, you'll notice we got a booth that'll make down into a bed. 
You got a couch over here that will make up into a height of bed. So if company decides to show up on your vacation, you got a place to put them. Day night shades, uh, residential tile, style lighting, windows that open, stainless steel package which consists of a stove with a three burner uh, or oven, three burner stove, stainless microwave, hood vent, fan, all that good stuff. Of course nothing works now because we didn't put the new batteries on until you buy it. Stainless steel package, Norco refrigerator. You know what's so neat about these Norcoles? This. Notice I got the other hand over here. I got it in my pocket. I only need one finger to open up that door. And then when I get it open, I don't have to worry about having the other hand free to catch stuff that falls out because it's a Norcold. I got a recessed freezer here. Again, nice big vegetable crisper. Even got a spray on shower for outside. Drawer underneath your stove. Everybody's looking for pots and pans storage. Everybody's looking for storage. Notice that the sides of your drawers are all five and seven ply plywood, not plastic, none of the stuff like that. Good storage throughout. Comes with a TV. How about this? Boy, this is really rough in it, isn't it? Got a fireplace underneath the TV. Got the stereo, got the TV. All sitting right here. Of course, this is on a turnstile pedestal. If you decide to sit over there where the breeze is, pull the TV out, turn it that direction. So, being a bunkhouse model, we got to put some mug beds in it. This is heavy, big enough that even I could crawl up there and not fall on top of whoever's below me. 300 pound capacity. Notice the storage underneath this bed. So if you didn't want to get on your hands and knees, all you got to do is turn this up. There's a spot to put some bicycles till you get to where you're going. Then you pull them out and then you lock them up so that they're there in the morning. Got a curtain to give you some privacy. Always closet space. You've got pantry here, another little pantry here. And get this, let's talk about pantries and storage. How about that? Now, you know, you could do a couple different configurations if you didn't need that much pantry space. Maybe a hanging closet, maybe your square dancer and you're gonna take your suit and tux and your square dancing stuff and throw it in there. You got the TV cable no longer have to crank it up and remember to put it down. This is all directional. Just turn it to pull in the best reception. Then, of course, the old throne room. Got a very adequate shower with a skylight up above it. You got a porcelain toilet aimed so that you don't have to kiss your knees while you're on the commode. Got a sink, medicine cabinet, another pantry in there. Now, if you got any further questions, my number is right down here. Everybody calls me JR or the guy on the Harley. You'll get me. Come see me. Let's get together and let me show you. I have over 450 units. If this isn't quite what you're looking for, I can probably come up with 20 to 25 more of different brands. So again, John Richardson, really appreciate the time you took to listen to me. Thank you so much.